Hi everyone in Brick Code Lab. Today I'd like to show you how to use the movement blocks in EV3 Classroom software. Motor blocks make only one motor run at a time. When you want to run two motors, you must use events or messages. Movement blocks enable you to run two motors in synchronized motion by one block. Only two motors of the same type can be synchronized. First you must select the motors you want to run together. Now you can move vehicle forward and backward for rotations, degrees and seconds. In movement blocks you can define straight variable to turn vehicle left or right. With straight zero the vehicle drives forward. Both motors rotate in the same speed. With positive values vehicle turn right. Right motor rotates slower. With negative values left motor rotates slower, so vehicle turn left. The greater value of the straight variable causes that vehicle rotates more. If you insert a block set movement motors to hold position at stop, the motors will be blocked. If you choose float, you will be able to move stopped motor. In the next video I would like to show you how to make a wall follower, so don't forget to subscribe and see you next time.